guys, so I just wanted to hop on here real quick and give you guys my August um, closeout, August results, whatever you want to call it. Um, I know I haven't been uploading as much as I should, it's just there's a whole lot going on. I think we're going to stick to just paycheck budgets and um, cash stuffing videos. We're not going to do weekly check-ins or anything like that. Um, just because of time constraints and um, all that. I got school going on, I got work going on got dogs you, you know how it is it gets busy around here so let's look at some of our results for this month um so for our debt repayment I got a cute little sticker up here um we were able to put a total of eight hundred and seventy dollars and fifty six cents toward debt last month that's incredible for us little nerdy people um that would be a 16.7 percent debt progress and a for the month and then a 38.8 percent debt progress overall that is fantastic i love to see those numbers um we paid off our smallest student loan this month which is so exciting um but i will let you know that in the next next month we're not going to be putting much toward um the student loans just because we have a washer repair coming out that month. We have a large vehicle repair that you'll see in my September setup video. Um, but we have a large vehicle repair coming out and then uh, I'm also gonna get my hair done. Guys, yes, we need to live on a budget, but it's important to do self-care. And I have, I've wanted to dye my hair forever, but I want it done right and that costs money. So I'm going to go get my hair done at a salon. I'll probably do a little vlog of it, um, which will be fun. A little memory of that for me and so you guys can see it. But yeah, so that is our debt progress. And then if we move into our August net worth tracker sheet, um, we have all of our assets here, uh, which includes our general savings. This is our emergency fund and some Christmas savings and savings for a few other things. Um, and then our truck and our car, which are fully paid off. We own those free and clear. And then the TSP is my husband's retirement. I don't have a retirement currently, um, just because I have, have never had a job where I could contribute to retirement. Um, but hopefully I applied for a, a small, tiny promotion kind of at work. Um, it would just, I would have the option to have benefits uh, instead of, as of right now, I don't have that option. Um, so that's exciting. And if I do get that job, I will be, um, after my student loans are paid off, I will be contributing to a retirement. So that's exciting. Um, and then this is our remaining loan balance, which is $3,191. Cannot wait. For that to be gone um but we are also going to be switching tactics um uh, in the coming months and i'll explain that when we get there uh but basically the thing is when you grow up um sometimes you just get anxiety about things and i have anxiety about money and my husband pointed this out to me and he made a good point um my overall goal is just to be debt free by the time i graduate college i want to graduate debt free so what that means is I need to have them paid off by May 14th because that's the day I graduate. So currently with the new setup, they're going to be paid off in about February or March, um, which is fine by me. And that's also a conservative estimate. With this new job, I might be having more hours, so I will be getting more income that way. So that's exciting. Um, but yeah, so those changes are coming up. So we'll be saving toward the emergency fund and the debt. Um, and I have a, a little color tracker for the emergency fund too. It's going to be so fun. Okay, and then this is our monthly budget. I didn't do the percentage of income or anything. Um, but yeah, this is just everything we spent money on this month. And savings I have lumped here. This one I do like to look at. Uh, the where did my money go breakdown in this workbook. So uh, this was our total monthly income, which is fantastic. I'd love to see it. Um, that was our debt payoff. Was, so our debt payoff was 23% of our monthly income. That's amazing. And we were also able to save 15.86% of our income. That's sinking funds, bigger savings, all those things, um, which is really exciting, guys. We That means, okay, let's do some quick math, okay? 38% 38, 38 went to debt or 
savings. That's incredible. Both of those raise your net worth. That's great. Um, but yeah, and that's the breakdown. 65% of the debt payment went towards that little loan that we paid off. And then 35% went toward the bigger loan. And that's all I have for my August um, closeout slash results. Um, what I do love though, I'm so happy I bought these stickers, guys, um, because they're so, like, this is so satisfying to look at at the end of the month. Um, I'm really excited to do my sticker setup for September um, in my September setup video. So super excited. Um, but yeah, so that is that. And I will see you guys in the next one. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more like this. Um, and I hope you guys have a great day. Comment down below uh, what makes you happy about your budgeting system. What brings you joy? All right, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.